Hi friends, thank you for joining me again uh, for this flip through. Uh, this is my first Christmas journal. Well, uh, I was really excited that I am f I finished it, but it's because I haven't been well the last few days. Uh, and um, rather than sitting down watching Netflix, um, uh, I decided to unplug and uh, come and um, do my junk journaling, which is my happy place. So thank you for coming and having a look uh, what I've done. So this is my first page and that's a mini calendar that I made. I just decided to put um, this hymn sheet in. Uh, the reason why I did that is because I'm f reminding myself of God's grace. Because, um, so this actually, um, I don't know about you, but um, Christmas is always a very busy time for everyone and I'm usually stressed and tired. And I must say that I used to take Christmas for granted. Not until COVID happened and for various reasons um, we weren't able to meet up again and and that was and that was um hard and i realized um looking back that we cannot take things for granted um whenever we have uh something special like christmas or even you know meeting up with a friend it's actually a blessing. It's an, actually an opportunity. So ever since that time, I decided to be more intentional about memory keeping, uh, about remembering and giving thanks for that day or giving thanks for that time. And that's actually that's the reason why I decided to make a Christmas journal. Actually, to be quite honest, you know, <clears throat> um, Christmas is usually stressful, but I, I, I really wanted this year. I was very intentional, I in in um, wanting to remember this time. And I also have aging parents, and it could be their last time. So that's why it 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 will be a special um, memory for me. And so I've I've just um left that. Uh, for things that I can be writing uh, later on um, and just done a tab there there we go and I like using uh, paper clips and sometimes I've actually done it like this with a love heart and the elements on this page uh, mostly came from Kaiser Craft which is nice Right, and so I just wanted to show you here. These were the tags that sat in there, but for the first time I made a pocket, so it looks like that when there's nothing in it, and then things can go in it like this. And <coughs> these I made them myself too. So I gingerbread houses, they look so cute, don't you think? I uh, use Posca pens to to draw that, and so that's another page for photos, or uh, it could be uh, just memories which I would like to jot down. Uh, that's fine. So I've left a few pages blank, as you can see, so that I have an opportunity to do it after after um, Christmas. <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. That was a fly. It's nice being out here today. Um, yeah, it's nice and uh, to have the sun out. And so, this is another one I did. Um, I love using uh, excess material um, for um, to make it. You can use um, like this one. You can use twine. Or excess material that you cut out and just make the little uh, tags a little bit prettier I think and 
this flower is a dried flower. I don't know what it's called, but it feels like 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 paper. Um, if you know what it's called, uh, let me know in the comments. Um, but it's very vibrant. I really love the colors, don't you? And here, uh, I decided to write a verse on there. Uh, I like using black paper. I'm not sure about you. Do you love black paper? I think it, it provides a nice contrast. This here, I actually just drew that this morning. I wanted a, a photo of the nativity, but I didn't want anything colorful or complicated. I found this vi YouTube video of uh, how to draw a, like a, a, a very simple drawing of the, the nativity, and I decided that I was going to do that. Um, and just practicing my cursive writing or, or you know, um, my writing. Yeah, it's okay. And here, a couple more, few more pages um, <clears throat> to put in photos. Now, I like to print the little photos, the mini photos from Kmart. Uh, I'm not sure if you know about them, but they're just the best for little journals like these. There you go. Use the ribbon, Christmassy ribbon. So sometimes you can buy ribbon, but other times I just use fabric um, because I've got quite a lot of um, unused fabric. You know, it's junk journaling after all. It's you know I'm just finding new new ways to to use up material that's been sitting there, off cuts and things, um, and. These are coloring cards. I've just made a little shelf for it. And this one here, I wanted to put some Christmas carols in my journal. I found this, this from this website. Can you see that? From the Flanders family, flandersfamily.info. Go to their website and download this if you're interested because I, I love it because these are all the words of the carols and um, you know it's a reminder of the songs that we sing during Christmas and I think that that's pretty special. So thank you our Flanders family if you are watching this video. Thank you so much for blessing me with that. And that will sit in here, and it's my belly band. A belly band holds it all together. And I did a little bit of mixed media here, as you can see. And this one here is a collage. I cut up strips of a magazine and decided to do a collage. So it's a mixed media piece. And so more pages there for uh, writing and reflection. And this one here, remember him if, well, him, I uh, remember it, um, the box that I bought. Uh, it was, um, yeah, I bought the, uh, the uh, tea, tea lights, not not the I bought the I I bought the item because of the box, not the tea lights. Shame that's right. <laughs> anyway, uh, can you see that tissue? Um, I did that because it reminded me of snow. Yeah. So well, that's my flip through, but I just wanted to bless you guys with a pack a Christmas giveaway pack because I had all these extra things that I thought someone would like to start their own Christmas um, journal so if you are interested you can um, put a word that resonates with you at the moment it could be hope 
peace, growth, um, patience, and um, hit the subscribe button and put a like on, on my video and I will on Wednesday next week. So that would be, I'm just trying to think of the date. Uh, I will put all the information um, uh, in the comments anyway. Um, and you may be one of the blessed ones to receive a pack from me for free. So I just want to thank you for watching. Hope that you have a blessed week and have a good day. See ya. Bye.